A pie cursor is a modified tracking menu. Here we show a tracking menu that is a set of 3D navigational tools. The tracking menu moves with the cursor when the cursor hits the edge of the tracking menu. This property allows the menu to be positioned on the screen under the cursor as the cursor moves. Clicking on a command clicks through the menu and activates the command at that specific location. One drawback of the tracking menu is that some users feel their cursor is trapped in the menu. Also, while the tracking menu is see-through, some users dislike the large graphic when compared to the cursor by itself. To address these concerns, we've developed the Pi Cursor, which is a miniaturized and modified tracking menu. It's reduced to cursor size, and to permit access to all commands in the menu at this size, a radial layout is used. The system cursor is hidden, but still active to select commands. In effect, the Pi Cursor becomes the cursor, albeit one that has eight functions attached to it. This arrangement allows rapid tool switching in place. Here the user quickly switches between orbit, zoom, and pan without using hotkeys or trips to and from the toolbar, all the while staying focused and at the location of their work. We conducted a formal experiment to investigate the performance of the Pi cursor. We compared it to larger tracking menus and the standard toolbar. We also varied the number of commands between 4 and 8 and the size of selection targets from large targets to very small, precise targets. We found both the tracking menu and the pie cursor outperformed the toolbar, especially on large targets. Notably, the pie cursor was 21% faster than the toolbar. We conclude that the pie cursor is a promising technique for rapid in-place command switching and operation.